the constitution of india preamble we the people of india having solemnly resolved to constitute india into a sovereign socialist secular democratic republic and to secure to all its citizens justice social economic and political liberty of thought expression belief faith and worship equality of status and of opportunity and to promote among them all fraternity assuring the dignity of the individual and the unity and integrity of the nation in our constituent assembly this 26th day of november 1949 do hereby adopt enact and give to ourselves this constitution hi students welcome back to the accountancy class i hope all are doing well okay so in the previous class we discussed how to calculate interest on drawings under different situation in that three cases completed what is the first case when the amount of withdrawal date of withdrawal and rate of interest is given in such a situation how to calculate interest on drawings that is interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into period rate into period that is the formula for the first case in what is the second case when the amount of withdrawal and rate of interest are given but date of withdrawal is not given date of withdrawal is not given in a, in such a situation interest on drawings is calculated by using the for, formula interest on drawings is equal to amount of drawings into rate into 6 by 12 6 by 12 okay then what is third case when fixed amount is withdrawn at every month in that the the fixed amount is withdrawn on the first day of month middle of month or last day of every month first day of month middle of month or last day of month see in that when fixed amount is withdrawn on the first day of month what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 6.5 divided by 12 okay then when fixed amount is withdrawn on middle of each month what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 6 by 12 6 by 12 then when fixed amount is withdrawn on last day of every month what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 5.5 divided by 12 okay so i hope all are clear okay so today we are going to discuss the fourth case different amount withdrawn at different intervals what is it different amount withdrawn at different intervals see when different amount withdrawn and date of drawings are clearly stated so the interest on drawings may be calculated with the help of product method with the help of product method see the procedure for uh, calculating interest on drawings under product method the first one what is it 
calculate the time period calculate time period between data withdrawal and closing date so the first step what is it calculate time period okay so time period is calculated from withdrawal date to closing date then after that second step what is it multiply the time period multiply the time period so calculated by respective amount of drawings called product this is called product and after that add up the various products and add up the various products and then last one what is it calculate interest on drawings on month one month on one month on the sum of product at the right of percentage what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to sum of product into rate into 1 by 12 what is it interest on drawings is equal to sum of product into rate into 1 by 12 okay so what is the case different amount withdrawn at different intervals okay so i hope all are clear okay on the basis of this we can discuss the first example okay see arjun is a partner in a firm and his withdrawals for the year ended 31st december 2002 are as follows that is january 31st rupees 3600 March 31st rupees 2400 June 30th rupees 4800 August 31st 1200 October 30 that is 6000 charge interest on drawings at 5 percentage per annum calculate interest on drawings by using product method by using product method see here in this question they are given the withdrawal amount withdrawal amount and withdrawal date and also closing date also given and then interest rate also given so on the basis of this can ascertain the interest on drawings okay listen carefully okay let us solve the problem okay so now we want to calculate interest on drawings and the product method so for that the first column date then second column amount then period then product okay so here date date means withdrawal date the first withdrawal date what is it january 31st so ja 31st january 31st january 31st january is the withdrawal date so withdrawal amount how much that is 3600 3600 and then period period we want we want to calculate period so that is from withdrawal date to closing date when it is the withdrawal date that is 31st january what is the closing date closing date 31st closing date 31st december 2002 31 december 2002 is the closing date so from withdrawal date to, to closing date so that is withdrawal date 31st january so that means uh, 31st january so we want to uh, count Feb february march april may june july august september october november december how many months that is 11 months 11 months so that means 31st january to 31st december so that is 11 months and after that we want to calculate the product we want to calculate product so that is product means how product means Uh, amount into period what is the formula for calculating uh, product amount into period so amount into period see here amount how much that is 
3600 into period 11 months. So, 3600 into uh, 11 months that is uh, 39,600. 39,600. Okay. So, and the next, next date, what is the next withdrawal date? That is 31st March. 31st March. What is the withdrawal amount? Withdrawal amount 2400. 2400. So, we want to calculate the period. That is 31st March. 31st March to uh, from 31st March to clo uh, closing date December. So, um, 31st March. So, uh, count from April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. How many months? 9 months. So, 9 months. 9 months. So, that is 31st March to 31st December. So, pr product that is amount 2400 into 9 that is 21,600. 21,000 it is 21,600. 21,600. Okay. Then next withdrawal date. Next withdrawal date what is it? 30th June. So, 30th June. 30th June. Withdrawal amount how much? That is 4,800. 4,800. 4,800. So, the period of 30th June. So, June to uh, 31st December. That is 30th June means we want to count from 1st July. July, August, September, October, November, December. How many months? That is 6 months. So, 6 months. 6 months. That is 30th June. 30th June to 31st December. So, the product 4800 into 6. 4800 into 6 that is 28800. 28800. Okay. And the next withdrawal date what is it? 31st August. That is 31st August. 31st August. What is the withdrawal day amount? That is 1200. So, we want to calculate the period. So, that means uh, August, September, October, November, December. That is 4 months. 4 months. So, that is uh, 31st August to 31st December. That is 4 months. Um, so, the period product 1200 into period 4 months so that is 4800 4800 so the next withdrawal october 30th so 30th october 30th october so that is withdrawal date how much that is 6000 then period we want to calculate period that is 30th october so october 30th means we want to count November, December. So, that is 2 months. So, 2 months. So, that means 30th October to 31st December. So, the product 6000 into 6000 into 2 that is 12,000. 6000 into 2 that is 12,000. So, that is the product. After that, we want to add this product. That, uh, that is the first one. 39,600 plus 21,600 plus 28,800 plus 4,800 plus 12,000. Total 1,6800. 1,6800. 6800. So, we want, we can write sum, sum of product. What is it? Sum of product is equal to 1,6800. 6800 this is the uh, sum, sum of product amount 16800 so what is the formula for calculating interest on drawings under uh, product method so interest on drawings is equal to 
so what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to interest on drawings is equal to what is the formula sum of sum of product into sum of product into 1 by 12 into rate 1 by 12 into rate so here sum of product how much that is 1 lakh 6800 into 1 by 12 into here rate how much that is 5 percentage so 5 divided interest period interest rate 5 percentage so that is why 5 by 100 so the answer 4 445 that is answer 445 that is the interest on drawings i hope all are clear how to calculate interest on drawings under uh, product method that means product method we are using product method when the when withdrawal is made at different amount of withdrawal is made at different interval different amount is withdrawn at different interval in such a situation we want to calculate interest on drawings by using product method okay i hope all are clear okay next i will give one homework you just to try to find out the answer okay so i will read the question hari and roshan are partners in a firm sharing profit and loss equally hari and roshan withdrawn the following amount from the firm for personal use date hari and Roshan here 1 1 Hari withdrawn rupees 5000 Roshan withdrawn rupees 7000 then 1 4 Hari withdrawn rupees 8000 Roshan withdrawn rupees 4000 then 1 9 Hari withdrawn 5000 Roshan withdrawn 5000 then 1 12 Hari withdrawn 4000 Roshan withdrawn 9000 interest on drawings is to be charged at 15 percentage per annum assuming accounts are closed on 31st december every year calculate interest on drawings okay this is the homework i think all are clear the fourth case okay next we can move to the fifth case what is it when fixed amount withdrawn every quarter what is it when fixed amount withdrawn every quarter so when fixed amount of money uh, withdrawn quarterly quarterly means every three months every three months by the partners in such a situation the purpose of calculation of interest the average period is ascertained average period is calculated depending on whether money was withdrawn whether the money was withdrawn on first day of every quarter that means first day of every quarter means uh, beginning uh, money was withdrawn at beginning or middle or at the end of every quarter so in that the first one when fixed amount withdrawn on first day of every quarter first day of every quarter in such a situation the formula for calculating interest on drawings interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 7.5 divided by 12 7.5 divided by 12 okay then when fixed amount withdrawn on the middle of every quarter what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 6 by 12 okay then when fixed amount withdrawn on the la last day of every quarter what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 4.5 divided by 12 4.5 divided by 12 okay i hope i think all are clear okay
so on the basis of this we can discuss the one example okay so manoj a partner withdrawn a sum of rupees 2000 per quarter from the firm interest on drawings is to be charged at 8 percentage per annum what is the interest that should be charged to the partners if drawings are made first in the beginning of each quarter in the middle of each quarter in the big the first one in the beginning of each quarter second one in the middle of each quarter and then third one in the end of each quarter actually this is the question so here in this question they are given withdrawal amount that is how much rupees that is 2000 per quarter here their withdrawal is made quarterly quarterly means 3 months quarterly and then interest rate also given and we want to calculate interest on drawings under first in the beginning of each quarter in the beginning of each quarter in the middle of each quarter in the end of each quarter okay in that the first we want to calculate the total drawings so to, so total drawings is equal to total drawings is equal to total drawings is equal to actually the withdrawal amount how much that is 2000 total drawings is equal to 2000 into 4 4 means what that is in an year 4 quarter are there that is 4 quarter means january february march then next april may june then july august september then october november december see listen see listen here january february march is the first quarter and april may june is a second quarter july august september is the third quarter then october october november december is fourth quarter so in an year how many quarter are there that is four that is why 2000 into 4 2000 into 4 means that is 8000 2000 into 4 that is 8000 i hope all are clear why this four four why this four that is in an year four quarter are there in an year how many quarter are there four okay so we want to calculate interest on drawings when fixed amount is withdrawn on the first day of every quarter when then what is it next calculation of calculation of interest on drawings interest on drawings calculation of interest on drawings in that the first one what is it when when fixed amount when when fixed amount withdrawn when fixed amount withdrawn on the first first day of day of every quarter every quarter see what is the formula that is interest on drawings is equal to interest on drawings is equal to total drawings total drawings into total drawings into rate uh, rate into 
7.5 divided 7.5 divided by 12. So here total drawing how much that is 8000. So 8000 into rate how much that is 8 percentage. So 8 divided by 100 into 7.5 divided by 12 that is 400. That is interest on drawings interest on drawings how much that is 400 so when fixed amount withdrawn on first day of every quarter interest on drawings is equal to 400 okay so next next when fixed amount withdrawn on the middle of every quarter middle of every quarter what is the formula that is interest on interest on drawings is equal to interest on drawings is equal to that is total drawings into total drawings into rate into total drawings into rate into 6 by 12 so here total drawings how much that is 8000 so 8000 into rate 8 percentage so 8 divided by 100 into 6 by 12 that is 320 so that is interest on drawings that is interest on drawings when fixed amount withdrawn on the middle of every quarter that is the formula what is the formula that is total drawings into right into 6 by 12 6 by 12 okay and next when fixed amount withdrawn on the last day of every quarter last day of every quarter what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to interest on drawings is equal to what is the formula total drawings is into total drawings into rate into 4.5 divided by 12 what is the formula when fixed amount withdraw on the last day of every quarter what is the formula total drawings into rate into 4.5 divided by 12 what is it 4.5 divided by 12 so in this question total drawings how much that is 8000 8000 into rate 8 percentage so 8 divided by 100 into 4.5 4.5 divided by 12 that is 240 that is 240 so that is the total uh, that is that is interest on drawings how much that is 240 so when fixed amount withdrawn on the last day of every quarter what is the formula interest on drawings is equal to total drawings into rate into 4.5 divided by 12 okay i hope all are clear okay uh, if you have any doubt please contact me Okay.